top global disaster risk hotspot per the latest World Risk Index report, fourth among all nations hit hardest by climate change. But a couple of unflattering worldwide distinctions the Marcus government seeks to reverse with an all-out and aggressive climate change agenda and strict marching order to his DENR chief. Our Clazel Perdilia has more. A powerful earthquake and a super typhoon, just a couple of major calamities that hit the Philippines this year. The World Risk Index reports show the Philippines leads the global disaster risk hotspot ranking this 2022. The Philippines acquired a 46.86 index score, which means our country is exposed and susceptible to earthquakes, storms, flooding, extreme heat, and other calamities. That is why, according to the Department of Environment and Natural Resources or DNR Secretary Tony Yulo Loizaga, Among the critical elements considered that require greater attention is the vulnerability of our environments, ecosystems, and our people. Today, the DNR conducted a consultation with 200 representatives from different countries, from different industries, to discuss steps and formulate policies to protect nature, achieve resiliency in the challenge brought by climate change. Loizaga revealed they tackled how companies should respond in reducing waste such as plastic. The Philippines is said to be one of the worst plastic polluters in the planet. One of the key developments that, that happened this morning is in fact a commitment from almost everyone on the panel you know, to work with us on plastic waste management. That will be translated now into working plans. The agency said it will focus in crafting a comprehensive roadmap toward ensuring water security which President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. wants prioritized. These are issues that require um, balancing of demand, but also the realization of what climate change means to supply and to the design of our infrastructure for delivery. The DNR also assured that under the new administration, the agency will conduct a climate and disaster assessment of government projects. The Kaliwa Dam project, which is designed to provide alternative water supply to Metro Manila, but feared to cause adverse effect on the environment, remains on the table. Kaleza Pardilia for the Nation.